summer's almost here so today I'm gonna do some coleslaw um, so I need the carrots the two types of cabbage and then I'll put it will be a no mayo coleslaw uh, then I'm gonna do some chicken wings and I'm also gonna make some potato wedges people have asked me how I do my potato wedges so I'm actually gonna go into more detail in, instead of just showing you when it's done so stay tuned the first thing I do is split the potato in half then you go at an angle so it's like that see so it comes out some you might be able to get four out some you can only get three out of it I'm left-handed so it might look strange but I'm quite funny see then I'm gonna soak them in some water to take a more of the starch then I'm gonna season it with paprika and black pepper let it sit sprinkle some um, oil on it and let it sit for about uh, half an hour then I'm gonna fry them now I'm gonna soak these so as I said to take some more starch out of it then we go from there That's it. But yeah, the other has been soaking for about half an hour, so now I'm gonna pour the water off and put the seasoning on it. Actually I'm gonna put the black pepper on it now. And the paprika. Then I'm gonna mix it in. I'm not gonna add any salt to it until it's done. Because um just in case I need to fry something else in the oil it's not salty uh, today I'm going to be using my deep fryer instead of using the blanche I'm on the stove and then put it in the oven I'm just going to put them in the deep fryer and cook them right through as time is against me I'm going to sprinkle some olive oil on it olive oil on it so uh, I can rub it on and also I got some seasoning from a friend of mine and I'm gonna it's good for meat but because I'm gonna be frying this I'm gonna add some to it big spoon spice it's very tasty so I'm gonna add a little to this and further rub it in I'm gonna let this sit for about half an hour to soak in the seasoning some more then I'm then I'm just gonna deep fry it when that's done I'm gonna do my chicken wings I've added some of the big spoon spice to this also to give it some flavor to finish my coleslaw I'm gonna put some uh, upside of vinegar honey and lime lemon juice and mix it with some oaks flaxseed oil that's the ingredient for the coleslaw I've shredded them already so I just have to mix it and put it in the fridge and we're good to go there uh -huh. lower the fire, the fire so I'm gonna put it in
and let that fry for about 10 minutes and they should be ready um, 7 to 10 minutes I think these are done This way you add fresh thyme leaves to it. And then here's where you add the salt to it. So the thyme will give it a nice earthy flavor. And then Put a little bit of that in it. Add some salt. And you should have an amazing taste. Just fry the rest to add to this, and I show you when I'm plating the food. It's all of the potatoes. Now I'm going to do my chicken wings. That's it. Everything is ready. Wedges, chicken wings, and coleslaw. Gotta make my dish now.